Let's see, where are we today? We have sold 1,329 tickets to the Homestead Festival. So 15 more tickets than yesterday. We are five flogs into our 30 days of a daily flog as we get ready for the festival. Yesterday was Mother's Day. I hope everyone had a wonderful Mother's Day. We had as good of one as you could have considering. We have had a busy weekend here at the farm. We had an event on Friday night with Bob Goff, which we'll talk about another time. And we also had concerts this weekend. I played on Saturday night and it was amazing. I only play one Saturday a month and not even every month right now. So it's only 10 concerts this year. And every time I do, it reminds me how blessed we are to not only have a concert hall here on our farm, but have all these friends who work with us to help make it happen. Now, when we started putting together the lineup for music at the Homestead Festival, I never had any plans to be part of it. I thought it would be fun just to help put it all together and celebrate all these other artists that are out there. But here in the last couple of weeks, everybody else on our team had a different idea. We went around to each one of them and asked, who do you think should be Kevin Costner's opening act here at the Homestead Festival? And surprisingly, they all said, uh, definitely you. Are you really asking me that? I mean, seriously, they're coming to your place. You should be opening for Kevin Costner. You're gonna do it, right? Who should open for Kevin? Well, Mr. Feek, of course. You want Roy to play at the Homestead Festival? Huh? Oh, yeah. Mm, Alabama. But since we can't afford them, I guess you should do it. You're not gonna charge us, are you? Who should open for Kevin Costner? Let's see, there's one person in this room who's not on the schedule who needs to be, that everybody's coming to see, and there's one open slot on the schedule, and his name... You should Papa! Hey, Papa, who's Kevin Costner? So it turns out I'm gonna be playing right before Kevin Costner on Saturday, June 4th, which is a little frightening and also pretty exciting. As we're sharing these daily vlogs about the festival, one of the things that's been important is trying to capture some things that are happening here at the farm as they're happening and sharing them with you. And so Saturday night, my nephew Michael, who's right there, he's very, very tall. We sent him around with a camera and said, what if you try and capture the whole event just in snippets? And he filmed all afternoon, all evening, till late at night, till they actually shut everything down and Indiana and I were at the farmhouse in bed. And he started putting it together and he only got about a third of the way through and he said it was so good, he couldn't get any farther. And so we looked at it this morning and he's right, he did an amazing job. So this is our concert on Saturday night, cut down to about three and a half minutes till the concert started. Make sure you wait around till the end. I got a very special artist on stage with me singing.
Brother. 